Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Orphas Fascinations. Today, I'm going to feature a very easy yet tasteful recipe. It's called Banana Apple Fritters. And it's one of my favorites back home. It's a good snack or you can also use it for dessert. But first of all, I would like to shout out to my friend Lily Basha. Thank you, Lily, for making my apron personalized with your embroidery. I really love it. And also to my new subscribers, thank you so much. And for those who have stayed with me from the very start, thank you for your continued support. And here we go. We're going to make our banana apple fritter. So come along with me. Well, first of all, we're going to gather all the ingredients we need for the recipe and this calls for bananas what i'm using here are the plantain bananas and the skin pigment is already dark but the inside is just enough ripeness and you can use also the chiquita bananas but if you do that just use the ones with specks because the riper it is the sweeter and it's better to use it that way and then, of course, we're going to need one teaspoon of baking powder, one teaspoon of baking soda, and to flavor it, we're going to use one teaspoon of cinnamon. And the main ingredient, other than the bananas and the apples, is two cups of flour, one half cup of granulated sugar if you want to make it a little sweeter, and also a cup of milk. And here's our baking powder, baking soda, and cinnamon that we're going to mix together. So we need to peel the bananas. You'll see it's really ripe and the more ripe the bananas are, the sweeter it is. Here I'm paring the apples with a knife, but of course you can use the peeler if that's more comfortable for you. But the reason why I'm pairing it this way is because I'm going to use the peel to garnish the fritters when it's already done before it is served so just continue pairing the apples and then when you're ready to cut them we need to cut them in small cube pieces so it will cook easier when it's deep fried with the batter After slicing the apples, you just gather the sliced of pieces and put it in a bowl and continue doing that until you're all done slicing the apples. And then we follow with the bananas. And what I did here, I was really rushing to finish the recipe or the preparation. So I just gathered the bananas and cut them across like coins and then after that I mixed all the sliced bananas to the apples in the bowl and I continued to cut them across uh, the, the coin slices that way it gave me smaller pieces or you can always have your way of making them cut in cube pieces and just like I'm doing here I just cut it across to uh, make the bananas into smaller pieces now here we gather all the dry ingredients after you're done with slicing the bananas you just put that aside and gather the dry ingredients start out with the flour and mix the baking powder, the baking soda, and the cinnamon. That uh, will give us the flavoring and add the half cup of sugar and then the liquid ingredient which is the milk. And just stir that together. If you can sieve the flour that's even better so it will take the, the clumps away. And then you just add the bananas and the apples, mix the batter uh, to make sure that everything is coated with the batter before you start the frying. Oh. 
So you can heat the oil. I'm using vegetable oil here, so that depends on your preference, what, uh, what kind of oil you're gonna use. And then once it's warm enough, I used a scoop, ice cream scooper to scoop the batter and start deep frying the fritters. Make sure to turn over the uh, fritters when you see the other side is turning brown so it doesn't burn and then you just deep fry it until you achieve the golden brown coloration and you know just make sure that you let it stay on the fire uh, for a little bit so the inside will cook because sometimes it's burning outside and the inside is not cooked so just try to use medium heat and here that recipe yield more than 20 pieces of fritters so uh, before you serve it you try to garnish so it will look uh, <laughs> better and attractive to to eat by orpa banana apple ba fritter banana apple fritter you cannot buy it somewhere else you gotta <laughs> try it <laughs> yum 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 <laughs> thank you for staying with me and i hope you'll try that in your kitchen and you won't be sorry if you do because it's very tasteful easy to make and it's good for snacks or dessert and please share my videos to your friends and families and invite them to you to become subscribers to my channel. And don't forget, a little bit of love goes a long way. Thank you everyone and we'll see you again in my next video. I love you all. Goodbye.